Yo, what is up guys? This is Ark. Welcome back to another Roblox video. Today, I'll be sh teaching you, showing you, teaching you how to create a Roblox Game Pass for 2017 and 2018. First one you want to do is go to the develop page. And then, uh, and then on the left side, this left panel, click games. And then, well, it, you have to let it load first. And then, find the game that you want to create the Game Pass on. Uh, go to the right gear icon by the right of it and click create click it and then click create a game pass create game pass Now you'll have to create game pass. So you'll have to choose a photo and then you have to name it And then you can make a description. You don't I don't think you have to make a description. I don't know and then you could click preview it'll again This always happens I'll choose this flowers automatic yeah I'll just gonna you can name it and I'm gonna make a description and then click preview once you're done <clears throat> then once it loads so it'll preview it for you the picture might not be there somehow it showed for me that's really surprising It'll preview it. if you're happy with it. Click verify upload. Now it'll just say Game Pass successfully created. Scroll down, find the one that was just created, click the gear icon, and click configure. <clears throat> so now, uh, scroll down and select sell this item and set the price to whatever you want. Now there is a 30% market fee for Game Passes, shirts, clothing, all that stuff, and things you sell. It takes away 30% of the robux the other people pay so if you do 10 robux you earn seven if you do 100 you earn 70. one ten thousand you earn seven thousand blah, blah blah yeah it just takes away 30 percent it's really stupid but uh we have to do it so now once you're done editing everything uh click the blue click the blue save button and then in the top url bar over here at the end of the link should be a string of numbers Copy that string and paste it somewhere. Keep it. You can write it down. Just keep it somewhere because we're gonna go back to it later. So now click this back button, or just go to your develop page. Yeah, just go to your develop page once you saved it and copied the ID. That's the Game Pass ID, the number, the string numbers. Find the game in the develop page and click edit. <coughs> All right, now. So now, and you should, I'll just remove all of this. Go to view, the view tab, click the explorer, properties, the first two, and then click toolbox. Now in the toolbox, on the left side here, click this little drop down menu, scroll all the way down, click Roblox sets. Oh, no problem. Click Roblox, click Roblox sets. Uh, now scroll down, and the last option should say Game Pass colon, and uh, you can't read it, it's too long. Click it, and then in the Explorer, it should insert an admin tool script. So now open the script, double click it, actually wait, no, don't do that. Click the little arrow, and then in the Game Pass, this thing, I don't know what this is called, the integer value, or int value, it just say Game Pass ID. That's where you go get your ID from your Game Pass that we put somewhere safe. And in properties, find the value part and click this and paste. I'm going to YouTube video. So in the value box, paste that Game Pass ID of your Game Pass. Press enter and now go to the model. Open the model tool, assets to load. There should be three choices, bear gun, 
poison picnic and troll pet. Uh, it de these depend on how many things you get in your game pass. I'm only gonna do one for the purpose of this tutorial. <clears throat> so now to to go to the catalog, you can't do models, okay? M a lot of people had trouble doing this because they chose models instead of uh, catalog items. You can only do gears from the catalog. I will find out how to do models in the next video. So, uh, find a gear, and then on the top your L bar. Again, find the ID of the gear. It should this time it should be in between two slashes in the link. Just copy it, and then go back to your Roblox Studio game, and in the tool assets to load, whatever whichever one you select, go to the value box and replace that ID with the gear ID. So now, now you're good, I think. Yeah, you're good. So you could save this online, save it online, and I will play it. Now, just a quick thing, you'll automatically own it because the game, it would be really stupid if you have to buy your own game pass you created. So, <clears throat> now, you go to your game where you created the game pass, click the store tab, and see it's here. And that's 10 Robux. They all say it's owned because you created it, but for other people it will show the buy button. So now you can play it. Okay, as you can see now, I'm in my game, and I have the kind. This is a really weird gear, but yeah, I have it because this is the gear I chose, and I put the ID. So yeah, if this does not require a builders club, I just have builders club. You don't need builders club to do this, and yeah, that's it, I guess. Also, if it does not work for you, try to rewatch the video, check everything you did, see if you did it correct. I promise I will upload a tutorial on how to do models. That is probably very easier. Very easier. <laughs> That's probably easier than this. So, for now, this will be it. Hope you guys enjoyed. Remember to hit that like button if you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you later. I'm out.